ever wondered why Ferrari SF23 had issues in the race despite the qualifying pace and Charles Leclerc's impressive pole positions in 2023. As we peel back the layers of the 2023 Formula One season, a pattern emerges. Charles Leclerc, driving the Ferrari SF23, secured an impressive five pole positions, placing him second only to Max Verstappen. Yet, the glory of the pole position seemed to vanish as quickly as the checkered flag was waved. Despite his promising starts, Charles Leclerc couldn't convert any of these pole positions into a win. The one-lap pace that had seen him lead the grid was mysteriously absent during the races. His best results were three second-place finishes in Austria, Las Vegas, and Abu Dhabi. Behind these results, a question mark loomed large. What was going on with the SF23 during the races that wasn't evident during qualifying? The SF23's performance in qualifying was a mystery, but Leclerc had an explanation. What was it about the Ferrari SF23 that made it so difficult to handle during races? Well, according to Charles Leclerc, the SF23 was extraordinarily sensitive to its tires. During qualifying when the car was fitted with fresh tires, the additional grip these tires provided compensated for the car's inherent weaknesses. However, as these tires aged and lost their grip, coupled with the car carrying more fuel, the issues began to surface. When you're racing against the clock, every second counts, and the slightest instability can cost you dearly. This sensitivity to tire conditions meant that the Ferrari drivers had a tough time maintaining their pace as the race progressed. The fresh tires were effectively a mask, hiding the SF23's underlying issues. But as the tires wore out and the fuel load increased, the car's problems became painfully evident. New tires were disguising the SF23's weaknesses but they became more obvious under certain conditions. So, how did these issues play out during actual races? Let's delve into that. Picture the bustling, adrenaline-filled tracks of the Mexico City Grand Prix. Ferrari was quick, agile, like a predator on the hunt, but only when equipped with medium tires. However, the moment they switched to hard tires, the SF23 faltered. It was as if someone had flicked a switch, turning a roaring lion into a meek kitten. This wasn't an isolated incident. Similar issues arose when the cars were driven in heavy traffic, or when the wind picked up, or even when the track temperatures fluctuated. The SF23 was like a prima donna, performing best under very specific conditions. Any minor changes to these conditions and the car's weaknesses were laid bare for all to see. It was a delicate dance, a balancing act of performance. The SF23's performance was a balancing act, with success or failure hinging on a very thin line. 